Test. Okay, we're set up. We're going to sh see the movie contest results of the uh, Blinken Area project. Um, so, without further ado, please give a warm welcome to the Blinken Area people. Hello. Yeah, very short. Uh, we need only five minutes for the winners. We uh, had a movie contest for our big project in the Harcade. You can see us for one hour. And yeah, the, yeah, the task was to create a movie for this device. It's called Troy Kate. I have no mouse. Ah, here. And yeah, the winner uh, of the first prize is Ephelon. I hope he's here. Applause. <laughs> ah, here it comes. And uh, the first prize is sponsored by SpeakUp. It's a decked phone. Applause for SpeakUp. <laughs> and uh, we have some BSD stuff for the second place. And this is Ursula. Please come up. I have only one hand. <laughs> and uh, the third prize is for Bart. For the movie Just a Joke. And we win a t-shirt of the t-shirt shop from uh, SMLX. Yeah, you can uh, choose a shirt. Yeah, that's all. Thank you very much. And now we have the closing event. The movies. <laughs> yeah, we have uh, some problems with Java. <laughs> and so we, uh, yeah, we, uh, can we take the camera here? On this uh, PC, the movie runs. <laughs> but this PC don't work with a beamer. We will provide all movies on the wiki and our blog and the website. Okay. Next one. We have a solution. Okay, that's all. Thanks. Hello, yes, it works. Please stay here, we're not done yet. We're going to have a closing ceremony. Um, it's bound to be wonderful, it's bound to be sad. Uh, also, meanwhile, start thinking about next time event. In three years, people need to start preparing the sequel to this. Start thinking of what you can do, lectures, volunteering, cleaning up, bringing nice tents, making wonderful movies, doing stuff, funding, Getting ideas, meanwhile, take a calm few minutes.
Um, we are going to start the closing ceremony. Um, there is a group of people standing there. Many of them have been working at this for a year, uh, sometimes a few hours a week. But the closer we got to the event, the weeks were getting crowded with more hours and weeks never had enough time. Um, lots of people are going to be called to the floor. Actually, if all volunteers would come to the floor, the room would be empty. So there is a sort of choice of volunteers. But actually, the first one I want on the stage is Aldert. Aldert. He's the one. <laughs> Rob, Rob Holgrijp has always been organizing these events in the Netherlands. When Rob, two years ago, said, I'm sorry, but this time I can't, there was a bit of a defeated silence. And after a couple of months, half a year perhaps, Aldert at one point said, okay, I'll do it. He has done it. And of and there's lots of people There's lots of people who, who he could not have done it without. So all of you, please, on the floor. Jadi derde? Jadi daar? Misha Koen. Koen. Krijg nog een scherm? Zo, dat was easy. Het actually was easy. It was very easy. Because um, I had help. And if you have help, things get easy. Um, we got this slide. First announcements. Garbage bags. If you leave the area, please uh, collect them at the info help desk and put all your garbage in there and deposit those in the garbage uh, tanks. Thank you. We keep the bar open till midnight so that you can use all your coins left in your pocket for booze. Um, and the camping really stops tomorrow around noon. Uh, so if you stay for the breakup, we will accommodate you. But uh, please uh, try to leave be tomorrow before noon if you are not helping with the build-up. And uh, a, a small reminder, uh, yeah, whatever. Uh, <laughs> and we still need volunteers for the bar because we want to still op be reopened tonight. Security needs some volunteers if you like to help them out in the traffic controls maybe as well. And uh, if you stay for the breakdown on Monday and Tuesday, we will have some uh, food, drinks, and some other stuff. So now we go to the fun stuff. When we uh, found this location, um, lots of people in the organization fell in love with it because it's really beautiful. 
we have all these little uh, uh, little secluded areas, and that is a really fantastic uh, area. So I would like to thank the Easter Hill, the Paasheuvel, for accommodating us and helping us as much as possible. Uh, those people are really great. So uh, round of applause for. This is uh, photos made from the air, made by uh, Jeroen. Uh, was Jeroen? Thanks, Jeroen. Yeah. Um, this is how it looked like the, when we were not here, and then uh, something happened that nobody expected. Oh, oh the lights can be off. Uh, I don't mind. Uh, this happened. <laughs> Those pictures are made by Sabri, so thank you, Sabri, for uh, making these pictures. And you can even see it more clearly here. Uh, let's see. Where does it work? So uh, we have here the, the big fields with uh, the Geravel village in the open BSD tent. The <laughs> BSD, sorry. And uh, the speaker tent, big one here with the crew field. And this is where the CCC dome is located at it lake. So um, those are the people who complained. Uh, and then uh, more people were over here. <laughs> it's not on the picture. Some numbers. So, if you uh, do your, uh, let's say, marketing right, you all of a sudden you have after four months you have 1,200 people who bought a ticket. That makes it really easy to organize this because you are daring to take risks. So I would like to thank everybody who bought this ticket in the first few months. This really helped this group of people to feel confident to do the thing and to spend more and more and more time. Otherwise, it's always this little bit, ooh, are we going to make it? Things like this rock. Thank you very, very much. And this is the reason why we were sold out. So, event phone. Uh, I think we have more than 884. This information is, of course, an hour or two, you know, old. So uh, things change. But uh, this is a record all time for event phone. So uh, thanks, uh, Sasha and the whole team. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and I would like to thank uh, Martin, especially for the macchiato. Martin, uh, thank you. Uh, that uh, also means that uh, we had like 25 portafones, which uh, I uh, stopped using two days before the event because the DEX phone network was so solid that I could do everything that I wanted with the DEX phones. It really helps organize a hacker conference. It, you cannot be without it, so, so you know. Uh, this is another picture that I, uh, uh, well, stole from the NOC people. Uh, I found it quite impressive, uh, the 3.5 gigabit, but uh, apparently it's not. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> uh, so yeah, um, yeah. Next time, uh, bring more computers or something. <laughs> so, but uh, and then we have of course the power people who made a really nice list of uh, how much you uh, ruined the environment, <laughs> and uh, you did uh, quite a good job, I think. Uh, especially because uh, we did enough power for 13 years of an average household in uh, mere eight days. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, maybe next time we will start selling carbon credits. So, uh, thanks, Tino, Timo, and his team. Um, yeah, next one. <laughs> This is the bar. <laughs> no, you really recognize this. Uh, always a lot, uh, lots of Germans uh, at uh, the Dutch camps. 4,000 bottles of clubmaten. <coughs> You're all crazy. Um, seven, <laughs> because that stuff is not good. Uh, 750 liters of Coca-Cola. Uh, 2,000 liters of beer. So we have like a mixed audience. Yeah, you have the beer drinkers and the clubmaten drinkers. And. Uh, <coughs> Now we come to the next point. I would like to thank uh, a lot, and this is maybe a change from previous events, but uh, you know, I have my own way sometimes. I would like to thank the sponsors. These sponsors made so much possible, it's not normal.
especially I want to like to thank you, you, the audience, because you participate in such an awesome way, because we have like 2,100 people here, and we have 1,338 registered users on the wiki. The participation was so sky high that we had to slow you down from coming to the campsite. You were really coming in, in hordes. We were overwhelmed from day one. We were like expecting like 30, 35 people on day one, 70 people on day one, something like that, or 60. It was like, ah, you know, you have to, all of, all of a sudden you have to start the bar earlier, you have to put the generators on earlier, everything has to be, you know, accelerated. Uh, but luckily uh, with uh, this uh, awesome group of people and uh, their uh, help, uh, we were able to do this. Uh, but uh, wow, um, if you uh, really see, um, um, that's one of the advantages of organizing an event and everybody buys his ticket up front so soon uh, because everybody, uh, you know, because we can prepare for a year. One of the disadvantages is that you can prepare for a year. So, <laughs> and that's also an advantage again because wow, what a nice project we have seen the last few days. But I really would like to thank all the audience for bringing all their stuff and the equipment. I think we have 25 trucks of 10 tons and more arriving you know, uh, over the whole five days that we did the build-up. So I wonder how you all did at home. Now, um, this is, uh, we're going a little bit 2600 style. Uh, I would like to uh, uh, have all the team leads uh, say a little bit in a few seconds. You know, it's like the awards don't go for over 30 seconds. Uh, and, um, you know, thank anybody you want to thank. So switch off this one and uh, let's go um, in with the microphone. You want to take it? Keep working. <laughs> Come on, well, Mendel, you can better. I do want to thank some people. Uh, some people are actually still working while I'm uh, relaxing here. So I want to really thank all the shuttle drivers who took the time to uh, drive all you people to the parking lot because you were too lazy to walk. <laughs> and drive people to the train station and they will still be driving now and too late in the night. So uh, uh, be thankful for them. There's apparently a coward next to me here. Um, well, from the security, first aid, and traffic teams, thanks everyone for being very silent after 11 o'clock in the evening and for not getting yourself injured too much. I got reports from the first aid volunteers that they were bored, so thanks for that. <laughs> I would like to thank all the people that helped behind the bar. At the most strangest times, we had volunteers that were coming on time, that were uh, giving us a hand when it was needed. Uh, my team that was working 24 hours a day, and especially Jan, Jan Baumeister. <laughs> uh, okay. For, for, the, for the moment, he's standing in front of the bar tent telling people that we're closed, <laughs> which is thanks to uh, uh, Albert and Misha that they were able to close it down for about an hour during the event. That's the only hour that we were actually closed, and that never happened in uh, the last four times that we did this. So, great. <laughs> and thank you, thank you all just for uh, all the participation and, and everything that we did and that you did. Um, behind the bar and uh, in front of the bar. Thanks. Um, I'd like to thank all the speakers who came here and did their talks, their lectures, their sessions, the workshops. Um, we only had three or four cancellations, so we we're quite happy with that. Um, and from volunteer coordination, I'd like to thank all the volunteers who've helped us. And I'd like to remind you that we're still looking for lots of volunteers for the breakdown, for driving. So if you're still here tonight, tomorrow morning, please um, report and help with uh, build, uh, breaking all this down. Thank you.
I'd like to thank everyone who helped out on, on AV. I mean, uh, building up, uh, doing all the talks, uh, doing the lights. Uh, the Monday, the tenth, we came here in here. It wasn't. A, it, it started out as a, as a farm shed, pr probably. And Friday, uh, you see the theater we're standing in now. So we did a lot of work, and as we speak, we're already breaking down the second uh, speaker track, and uh, we're going to do a, start breaking down uh, as soon as possible. Uh, everyone, thanks. And I'd also like to thank our suppliers, uh, Roy and Jasper, who are breaking down right now and couldn't be here. And uh, behind us, uh, Leonard and Martin, and everyone uh, who helped out on the, on the shifts. The network, we already had our 30 minutes, so I'm just going to pass it on. But thanks again, all our volunteers. And oh, on a side note, we're going to start taking down the network at 6 p.m. today. So sorry, but make sure to shut down your stuff, roll up your cables, put it in front of the dart and claw. We will start unplugging everything after this. Right, the power team. I uh, want to like thanks the people who helped the power team to set up the the whole uh, power infrastructure here. Uh, furthermore, uh, around six o'clock we're going to start switch off generators. So you have after this you have about one hour to shut down what you want to shut down, and then it will be gone together with the network. Uh, tomorrow we need lots of volunteers. We have got about as you saw earlier we've got about ten kilometers of power cable on the terrain, and it all needs to be gone by Tuesday morning. So please, tomorrow, if you want to help dragging some cables, report back to me. Thanks. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I really didn't prepare for this. Um, but I need to thank some people, too. So stand up. Oh, God. Um, uh, I have another person I really need to thank. It's Survivor. Um, I, we couldn't do this without him because we would was too busy with the scolo. <laughs> so thanks. from Team Riesch, and um, I have a quick announcement. Um, the site will be down in, a, in an hour or so. It will be back in a few days. We are working on the archive, and probably somewhere next week, all the um, talks will be available for download and for streaming, so that's basically it. So uh, I also want to say thanks to the volunteers, um, because um, A, they were very good, and we almost didn't have to ask for them. We are probably very, uh, had a very, very easy time because people kept joining in, so thanks especially to the, these people. Uh, well, I already have my turn at Wi-Fi, but uh, well, thanks for using it, and let's all use it after this closing event to create a large peak in the statistics. Well, I'm part of Team Food, uh, who cooked uh, this week for all the volunteers, and uh, I hope everybody enjoyed it. And I want to do a special thanks to all the people who helped out cooking, cutting, and doing the dishes until 1, 2 a.m. at night to get everything cleaned up and make sure that everything is uh, nice and clean. So, thank you. Well, I don't have much to say. Uh, thanks everyone for coming. Um, goodbye and thanks for all the fish. Well, um, 
Thank you as well from the radio team. We had set up a radio station, you might have noticed. Uh, we will continue to broadcast until midnight today, and then uh, our license is uh, ending. So please, if you have a possibility uh, to listen to the radio, do continue to do so, uh, because we are having a lot of a farewell show starting at 10 p.m. So that tonight. So if you want to listen, you are mostly welcome to do so. Thank you for being here. I, I'm uh, responsible for the web team, which is kind of fun because Wednesday night we didn't have a web team, and then the Thursday morning uh, we were discussing, well, it might be nice to have a web team, so we uh, hang up some little posters asking for people, and within an hour we had like 20 people saying, yeah, I can do PHP, I can do CSS, I will help. So that was really cool, thanks for that. Uh, thanks also for the reporters. Uh, we had some reporters out here uh, making some nice notes, writing nice stories, so thanks for them. Round of applause, please. And of course, uh, thanks to uh, all our wiki users. Uh, this year was really great because it's the first year that we used actually uh, user-generated content, so everybody could create their own uh, news uh, article on the front page. At first, it was kind of scary because uh, well, we didn't know what should happen, but uh, eventually everything went well, so uh, thanks all for that. Thank you. Um, I just would like to take this opportunity to thank the rest of the organization for the support. It also hasn't always been very um, easy. Um, so thank you guys. Um, it was really great working with you. Yeah. I'd like to um, thank the board, um, Kuhn and Albert and Misha. They did great work, took a lot of responsibility and, uh, well, give them a big applause. We, we're not done yet, we're not done yet. I really want to thank the, the people that took all the work out of, out of my hands, the, the, the guys and the girl in, in the back office who've been sweating away there, away from all the fun and, and, the, and the party. Um, I want to mention uh, Gerard, Gerhard, uh, Sven, Downhill, uh, Jella, and uh, not to forget, last but not least, uh, Stan, who is over there and is too shy probably to raise his hand, but thanks. One God. <laughs> And also a special thanks to security for keeping it all secure, because they've done a great job. Uh, also, with all the, all the things going on, they still managed to, to assist the back office in all the uh, coin transfers and everything. That was great. Thank you. <laughs> and then last but not least, and then I will give the microphone back to, uh, to Michel or Albert, um, the people who picked up all the work on the hard gate. I mean, I planned the hard gate and then I forget all about it because I had tons of shit to do and people just picked it up and made it a cool place to be. Thanks. So, okay, so we have some shy people and I can fix that. <laughs> so uh, I would like to thank the program committee for making such an awesome program. Uh, Karin Spijnk, Rob Hongrijp, Arjen Kamperhuis, Menzo Heus, thank you Menzo, uh, and uh, many others uh, who helped out a, a great deal with the program. I really appreciate uh, Alex Leheus, sorry, Stephanie Weiner, um, so yeah, all these names, uh, Jasper van der Waldenberg. Really, really thank you for helping and spreading the word and making sure that the right people were here 
uh, contacting as many technical and political you know, key figures to appear here in front of you. And in those three days or four days actually, I think it was awesome to see uh, how many people were uh, going to the lectures. Uh, we had, I think, only four cancellations. And I think uh, if you then leave with 100 solid talks, awesome. Thank you, program committee. Also, the design team, um, Helene, please stand up. <laughs> Helene made uh, the awesome, um, 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 what Misha and, uh, and I uh, said, uh, her another hip, hippie. Uh, outdoor logo that we all uh, love so much. And thank you very much for all your other work also involved. Erik uh, Bosman, they are our technical designer. <laughs> Who's responsible for uh, the app fractal? That's not me. And I'd like to uh, thank uh, Yildau together with Lotte for the, uh, um, for the lounge, which is really something that I really, really wanted. So thank you. <laughs> uh, let's see, we all, who else did we forget? Huh? Moom. Moom. Oh yeah, Klaatje Moom. She's probably not here because she had to go to the station, but she is the... Uh, the woman who made the big entrance, which uh, made it so much cooler uh, to uh, come to the, to, uh, to the campsite, <laughs> together with her vriendje, uh, Big Boy Rick. And I would like to thank that as well. <laughs> so what else did we forget? Uh, huh? Ah, Melvin, who made the... Bro? Melvin, who made uh, the cashier uh, registration system where you all pay through, uh, together with, uh, again, uh, Eric Bosman, making everything uh, very smooth with all the PayPal and the uh, credit card transactions. Really, uh, this is a great <coughs> piece of work. Thank you. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Melvin. So uh, uh, I, somebody whispered in my ear that I have to thank all the speakers. So uh, thank you for doing this for nothing, or barely nothing. That's a rare thing in this uh, world. And um, again, uh, that makes uh, this type of uh, event so special. Uh, really appreciate it. Uh, uh, thank you a lot. I almost forgot, uh, well, I, for my uh, opinion, one of the most important teams, the guys from Arc Event, who built all the light all over the campsite at night. Uh, so this uh, campsite or our event is not a boring thing at night, but really vibrant and alive. And uh, the light, wow, I'm blown away. Every single edition I go to, the what the heck, the CCC, and now hard, it keeps getting better. Incredible. Thank you, Arc Event. <laughs> There's one group of people who really are together, of course, with uh, the groups that are kind of solid, like the NOC, who have an experienced crew. Uh, we, we, and and, and we, we have one uh, special group of people who are, well, really also a part of the backbone of this event that uh, started a year ago or in four weeks with the preparation, so just like 30 months. And um, those are the people from uh, ATH0. 
Uh, they are really, really great group of new young hackers, a little bit uh, more pragmatic, uh, which I really like. Um, <coughs> and so uh, they are planning to do next year a smaller, more intimate summer camp, which, you know, about 300 of you are invited to. <laughs> and um, um, uh, more information on their website, if you would like to join this. Uh, it will not be, of course, um, uh, how they say it. It's, um, 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 they are the same, but HAR is a little bit bigger. And these are the people that are, it's plain awesome. They combine physical skills with thinking skills, which I've not seen before. So, Jan. Of course, I hope they don't uh, do their event in July uh, next year, 16 to 18, because that's the next hope. So, uh, Jan, please, <laughs> I want to go to both conferences. <laughs> um, now I go to the special thanks, and um, there we go. Koen, my phone is ringing. Lisa. When we uh, started doing this, now this will be on for a few minutes, um, I didn't know Kuhn, and uh, I think uh, we took quite some effort to uh, get each other to know each other. Um, we are not the same type of personality, and um, that was quite a challenge. And um, we made it uh, by the help of this uh, great guy, Misha. And um, yeah, um, communication, that's all about, which we did a lot. That's also uh, our uh, motto, plus one, that's how the way how we vote. And uh, that works really, really well. So, um, Misha, I could not have done this without you. <laughs> this is the end. I see this as a sign of appreciation, which I really am very grateful for. Uh, I would like to uh, actually mold this appreciation in helping us tearing this place down. So if as many people of you could stay for another day or two, you know, and help us uh, break everything up and uh, <coughs> put everything in big um, uh, trucks and uh, so we can bring everything down back uh, to where we rented from, uh, that would be very appreciated. Thank you very much and see you in next year at ATL0 and in four years at another hacker conference in Holland. <laughs>